Gansey Spills has left Mega at home on Valentine's Day to join Pacific Polo Cup in Indio from the 12th to the 16th of February. Prince Harry has landed in Indio, California after taking his millionaire friend's private jet to a polo field. The campaign in Royal boarded the 20-seater £45 million plane from his home in Santa Barbara, California on Sunday to go to a polo match in Indio. He took the one-hour flight, which could have emitted as much as five tonnes of CO2 shortly before he was pictured on horseback at the polo match. The Gulfstream jet is understood to belong to one of Harry's polo friends, Mark Ganzi. Ganzi is an American businessman. He's the chairman and CEO of Digital Bridge, and the founder and former CEO of Digital Bridge Holdings and Global Tower Partners. He's also a polo player. The polo tournament takes place over five days from February the 12th to the 16th. This also means that Harry will not be able to return home to Montecito until the afternoon of the 16th to see his wife and children again. But this event makes many people wonder if the couple's Valentine's Day will take place in the separation of distance. Many people also find it strange that only this year Harry participated in a tournament called the Constitution Cup. This has fueled rumours that the Sussex couple is having a marital dispute. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's relationship will begin to fracture, and they'll eventually break up, the psychic who predicted Queen Elizabeth's death believes. Craig Hamilton Parker, dubbed the new Nostradamus, told Metro UK that Meghan's relationship with the Duke of Sussex will begin to fracture, and they'll eventually break up, leading the father of Archie and Lily to become a deeply troubled man. He also predicted that the Duchess of Sussex will also end up with her own oprah styles chat show. The Pacific Coast Circuit Constitution Cup, hosted at El Dorado Polo Club in Indio, California, is played annually as the second tournament of the season at the 12-goal level. Antelope Jr. captured consecutive victories in 2018 and 19, with the streak put to an end by BenSalamini.com in 2020, returning in 2021 with the goal of beginning their own streak. BenSalamini.com returns three of their four players, adding Juan Cobello in place of Gustavo Uzidaga. The Antelope organisation will look to reclaim the trophy, building on their victory from the opening 12-goal tournament. Returning to the field at El Dorado Polo Club a team USPA, alumni Jimmy Wright, Thomas Alberti and Remy de Salili Muller. Utilising the same prize money distribution for the 2023 Gauntlet of Polo, the format guarantees a total of $200,000 in prize money. $50,000 will be awarded to each of the winning teams of the CV, Whitney Cup and USPA Gold Cup. Similarly, 100000 in prize money will be presented to the winner of the US Open Polo Championship, and any team that wins all three tournaments will be crowned the gauntlet champion. In keeping with the spirit of philanthropy, US Polo Assen will provide a 2500 donation to the winner and runner-up teams of all three finals to be donated to a polo charity of their choice.